our ultimate editable teacher planner allows you to set the starting year and month uh, which is great and once you do that it changes the dates throughout the planner which is brilliant um, so as we move to August I want to set it to August 2023 uh, and it changes all the dates but one thing it doesn't change is the name of the sheets down the bottom so as you can see here the sheet's name is July 23 and it's August 2023 so we need to change that um, the best way to do it is not to start on July and go that way because it will say you've already got a month called August 23 but to go to the last one and update it backwards so that's what I'm going to do here I'm going to go through change this one to September 24 and then work my way back through the months And that's it, it's done, and I don't need to do it again for another year. Hey, so just a quick update. We've had a few teachers asking whether we can put in a two-week timetable or they can put in the two-week timetable, and you absolutely can, but we've now added a version to the drive that already has space for a two-week timetable in it in both the horizontal and vertical version. So you've got uh, here week one at the top, and then you, have, you can either scroll down to week two or you can use the link um, in the cell there and it'll take you down to to week two and it works the same like I say in horizontal and vertical and that's in the Google Drive folder for everyone who's got access to it